can do this. No, you can't. No, you can't. <laughs> I love you. And no, you can't. <laughs> he did something wrong. He did something bad. He did something sinful. He did something hurtful and deceptive and vengeful towards someone that he cared about. He sinned. I have to. You have to. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying you and I have committed the exact same sin that this person committed. What I'm saying, though, is we're all in the same boat. By the way, this is not bad news. This is good news. <laughs> this, is, this is very good news. The fact that we should not try to depend on ourselves, but rather put our faith and trust in, that's great. Rejoice. Be glad about that. If you're going to be in heaven with God, because you're, because you're deserving of it, we're talking about this then. No sin ever, spotless, blameless, no blemish, completely, totally pure. A life of, to a life, not a few weeks, a life of total righteousness. How you doing now? <laughs> Here, here's something that can trip us up. The Bible talks about this. When we fall in love a little too much with the things of this world, oh man, it's going to be a slap in the face of American culture. <laughs> I love it. Pray for me. Rejoice, my friends. Be glad. Oh man, you ought to be doing cartwheels right now. I don't see enough cartwheels in this church. This is good news. This is your lucky... I'm, I'm here to tell you, you came on a great day. You came on a day when we got some great news. The victory has already been secured. Yeah. No, keep clapping. Keep clapping. That's how I tricked myself into getting a standing ovation. Oh, yeah.